Hi, my name is Darren Fink, and this is Dalton Linden Lane Fink. And we're here to do another Foster Adoptive Book Review for you. And what are we doing today, Dalton? I love you like crazy cakes by Rose. By Rose Lewis. By Rose Lewis, illustrated by Jane, Jane Dyer. Jane Dyer. So, I love you like crazy cakes. Let me read the inside to you. Based on the author's own experience, this heartfelt story follows a woman on her journey to adopt a baby girl from China. From paperwork to plane flight, the narrative chronicles the baby's trip from a crib in a big room shared with many other babies to her own crib in her own room in her new home. Jane Dyer's delicate watercolors perfectly complement the charming text a celebration of the love and joy a baby brings into the world. So, Dalton, what did we say? As the summary said, what did, who was the audience for this? At any ages? No. Not adopted in foster. For international adopted people, kiddos or families, right? Yeah. Because it talks about, it, it plainly talks about um, a little girl that's being adopted from China by her mother in the United States. It gives us and a hint about the colors because it's in black and white. So black and white colors means it's in the past. So, right, that's not the past. But what about the pictures? Did we say they were... What were they the, were so colorful. They were colorful and they were... Uh, they were realistic, weren't they? Yeah. So it's got some realistic images and illustrations in it that are nice and they're sweet. I think we said the ages for this was, you could read this to any kiddo. Uh, it would make an impact on them if they were adopted internationally. But it's probably geared toward, for uh, infant all the way to elementary school age. Um, this story, um, not really even a story like it said, it's just talking about Jane Dyer's own experience and what happened with her. So it is a touching and heartfelt mm -hmm. story. Um, our kiddos that weren't adopted internationally didn't really get um, pull a whole lot out of it, um, but there is a great opportunity for you if you've adopted internationally to insert your own story and to talk about how your own story looked different than this one maybe. Um, just on a personal note, uh, it, it, didn't, it didn't relate with me enough where I felt like I could get into the story and where I felt like I, I belonged or if it, it was a fun story that my kids could connect with. But that being said, I think it is a good opportunity for you to insert your own story and talk about how you adopted your own child from another country and what that looked like and the differences and similarities. Um, so it could open up for some great conversation and dialogue. So um, yeah, check this book out on our blog to see what the discussion questions are and see uh, if you think this book is something that you should bring into your home.